And folks, coming up next, ticket number two is up for grabs when Gokan Saki takes on Kimeo. Because we've got Go Gun Saki taking on Flashy Freddy Kamayo.
Wachi Freddy Camayo from Paris, France, that 28 year old makes his way to the ring. From Filipense, trained by Richard Roldi from the Falcon Gym. 6'1, 230 pounds, brings in an overall career record at 55, 16 and 1 with 45 knockouts. He qualified for the final 16 courtesy of a stunning win at the K1 European Grand Prix in Bucharest in May. Knockout Sebastian Chaban, who with a head kick in the final. His last fight was a first round knockout of Peter Vondracek in June in Slovakia. Has got an impressive 8 1 and 1 in his last 10, including wins over Sergei Lashenko, Alexei Igor and Stefan Leko. Looking to qualify for his first ever K1 World Grand Prix, Freddy Camayo. And he shaved the head and a bit to do so. You know, whenever you hear the techno beats, whenever you hear it thumping loud and hard, you're either walking past Gokan Saki's hotel room or you're hearing him walk to the ring. Where's a glow stick when you need it, Mike? <laughs> and a podium. Well, the podium's right there. We're just <laughs> short on glow sticks. and Bass Boone behind him. You don't mess with the Gokhan. Gokhan Saki, the Turkish leg slinger, 26 years old, 5'11 and a half, 210 pounds is the official weight. But I'm telling you, I have never seen Saki look this lean. An amazing career record, 70 and 13 and one no contest, 51 knockouts, and they are giving it up for the leg slinger. A Muay Thai stylist who won his first Muay Thai world title in 2003. In 2008, he won the WCFA Muay Thai Super Heavyweight title with a leg kick knockout of Englishman Chris Knowles in Shadham, which is where Saki was born. Comes in tonight on a fantastic four-fight winning streak, including a WCFA world title defense over Utle Mariana by first round knockout in February. A decision win over Sing J Deep in Yokohama in April. And a second round over Melvin Manoff in Amsterdam in May. He won the 2008 K1 USA Championship in Hawaii in just 5 minutes and 30 seconds. Terry threw Deutsch Boo, Rick Cheek and Randy Kim. That was actually during the best time of his career when he went on a 16 fight winning streak between 2006 and 2008, including wins over Ray Sefoan, Ruslan Karayev, Murad Buzidi, Paul Sawinski and Margaret Ahmed Magomedov. Great to see Gokhan Saki once again in the final 16. Have a look at Gokhan Saki here. I have never seen him in this condition. Mike, as I said earlier, he looks like a light heavyweight. He could even pass as a middleweight. Yeah, he does. And actually, this is a pretty interesting fight because neither one of them are really true, true heavyweights in the sense of a heavyweight. And they have very similar styles. A lot of them, both of them prefer leg kicks. Um, so I think this would be a pretty, pretty interesting fight. Well matched up. Final instructions from the center referee. We are set for three by three. Two extra rounds in case of a draw between Gokhan Saki and Freddy Kameo. Saki is so intense. Always has that true 
Turkish fighting spirit. Turkey have produced so many great kickboxing champions, of course. Taekwondo is very strong in Turkey. And Gokan Saki looking for yet another appearance in the K1 World Grand Prix. He will rely on his leg kicks here, Gokan Saki. Freddy Kameo, we call him Flashy Freddy for a very good reason. If he winds up those spinning kicks, you'll see something special. Four punch combination, exclamation mark at the end Whoa. by Saki. Damn! Whoa, did you see that? That was, a, that was a beautiful four punch combination, including a liver kick and a devastating leg kick to finish it off. It is the elite level of striking that is K1. You will not see it in any other combat sport. Gokan Saki did that to uh, Jay Hart. Sing, Sing Hot JD, if you remember, and that fight was just a beauty to watch. Kokan Saki always more combinations than a Sudoku puzzle, and he's already put it together well here in the first round. Catches the round kick on the forearm. Nice kick to the back leg from Saki. Counter left hand as Kameo gets his lead leg swept out. That was high up on the femoral profunda. Saki's leg kicks are just lightning fast. I mean, it is ridiculous how fast they are. Left hook from Saki. Oh, the right oh. hand takes Oh, he's wobbling. He's oh, he's wobbling. Can Saki this is finish? It. This is it. This is it as it gets an eight count. Freddy Kameo ready to take a trip down the boulevard of broken dreams. Freddy Kameo had no idea where he was at. He thought it was in Tour de France. I mean, this guy was out. I think he's still out. Watch. He's wobbly. He's gone. Faster, Saki! Kill, kill! Saki can finish this fight right now, and he Here will. Watch, watch, tuck. watch. He's gone. Here He's comes done. The tuck. He's done. Come on, big kibosh! The big kibosh! Whoa! This place has gone bananas! Freddy Kameo is astral traveling! You better call this one off, Brett! No, there's a minute left. He ain't getting out of this round. He's Saki. not getting out of this fight. This Saki. is it. This is it. Whoa! What a win! What a statement! Go get Saki, you crazy bastard! You've done it again! Unbelievable! Wow! I mean, you want to make a statement? This is a way to make a statement. This is the most decisive win we've seen in K1 in a long time. That is freaking K1! Whoa! Devastating combinations. Super efficient in striking, power, everything. I mean, Gokan Saki couldn't look any better. This is probably one of the best Gokan Sakis we've seen. And Freddy Kamayo is a no pushover. I mean, you don't just... Wow. There's, there's nothing else to say. This is a phenomenal win for Gokan Saki. Amazing scenes here in Seoul. Gokan Saki just abusing, just molesting, just dominating Freddy Kamayo. I want to see Gokan Saki and Tyrone Spong matched up for the final. That is going to be some fireworks fight. I told you, you don't mess with the Gokan. Freddy Kameo proven to be out of his depth here. My word! Saki just annihilated him. Unbelievable. I mean, if K1 had fight of the night, this should be a definite candidate to be put on there so far. Whoa! Phenomenal win. Unbelievable scenes here. Saki scales the ropes. Salutes the crowd. Well deserved. Well deserved. He needs he needs to get all the ovations he can master up because that was a great win. Mikey K1 bringing the good stuff here tonight. K1 is back. That's right. Oh. We're back. Okay, now it's getting a little out of control. Where's that lady where she goes? You know, the Oscars music starts playing. Time to leave the ring. <laughs>